हे एवरी वन वेलकम टू माई चैनल आई एम रजनीकांत एंड टूडेज वीडियो को ना डिस्कस फ्लाट मैप राइट सो इसे जावाइड स्ट्रीम्स फंक्शन दैट फ्लाट मैप इज ए मेथड सो विल डिस्कस वॉट एग्जैक्टली फ्लाट मैप एंड वेर एग्जैक्टली विल गो ना यूज दिस वन राइट सो प्लीज डू वॉच दिस वीडियो एंटायरली टू गेट ए कंप्लीट पिक्चर राइट सो बिफोर मूविंग टू today's topic if you have not subscribed my channel yet please do subscribe it immediately and hit the bell icon to get all the notifications from my side right so you will not miss any video if i will upload something okay so uh, this is my channel if you see a lot of git videos are there it's really uh, pretty interesting and useful for real time experience people uh, and here lot of j unit videos are there for Uh, writing uh, unit testing integration testing as well and uh, jacaco code coverage uh, tools and all the details and explanation is here and lot of crud operations and uh, uh, logical questions are also there if you are really interested you can uh, just have a look those videos right okay so let's start today's topic so flat map right so this is pretty awesome functionality uh, given in uh, java 8 java 8 stream api so we'll see what exactly this one right so the uh, here two part is there right flat and map if you see uh this is two parts are there flat and this is map right so this method whatever that flat map this method will do first it will map it will map whatever the input is coming it will map into something then it will flatten that output flatten that output right it will map the input and flatten that flatten that input to give output right so that is that thing that flat map and where exactly we'll apply this one let me let me quickly tell you where exactly we'll apply this one so if you see here already i have drawn something to uh to reduce that video length and time so one department list is there so it's a array list and it's contain department objects right so this array list it's containing department objects right so in each department have three attributes are there the department have three attribute id which is a string name is a string and list of employee right so it's containing a list of employee right a list of employee so department have three attributes id name and employees employees containing it's a list of employees right so if you see that employee object or employee that structure it's a string of id main department sorry employee id employee name and salary these three attributes are there with employee right so employee objects are one list is present over in department okay so if you want to perform anything inside that array sorry inside that list this list if you see this list then we we should go for flat map right one department is li department list is there and in that department list it is containing department objects and each department have list of employee and you want to perform anything to this list of employees right if you want to perform anything to this lists of employees then we should go for flat map right then we should go for flat map let me tell you two use cases right hope you got a, a clear picture when exactly we should go for a flat map right this is uh i will tell you some use cases so that you will get a better picture right so my requirement is that i need to identify that max salary max salary right i need to identify max salary of 
department ID 101. I need to identify max salary. What is that maximum salary of employees in the department ID 101? Right. So in the department ID 101, whatever those employees are there, what is that highest salary in those employees? Right. So how we'll do this one? So simple department list. This is a list dot stream. Then we are uh, we are filtering here, right? Department. We are specifying. 101 department so how so what we can apply here one filter which will take here what is this department right DEPT this is one lambda which will take a predicate and based on what we will do department DEPT dot ID dot it's a string right it's equals equals of one not one then dot here we'll do after this one after filtering apply flat map flat map right so here we'll get this department department dot uh, get employees here also get employees or uh, get employees get employees and here will this get employees will return what it's a list of employee right so here we'll do a stream So from here it will return a stream. Then again we'll do what? So here it will return return that stream of employee. So this flat map will return stream of employee. Stream of employee. Then here what we can do? Map. employee to what employee dot get salary get salary then what we need to do we need to get get the max one right so for the what for that one we need to map to double map to double this will return a double stream then only we will apply that uh, what maximum one okay instead of map directly we can put double as well here instead of map directly we can put double map to double and we can have this operation okay so map to double what we'll get department not department we'll get employee right this will return employee stream employee and here employee dot get salary get salary right and here we'll get max max function we can call right so this is that thing so where exactly will apply here so we want to perform operation on top of inside list right whatever that list inside the department object we are focusing on that one so this flat map what exactly it will do it will return a stream of employees right stream of employees so like this we can perform right so here what we are doing first we are mapping to uh what is that one we are mapping into stream then we are flattening 
right so one more use case i will give you so that you will get more clear right suppose what i want whatever those entire departments are there in that list i want highest salary in entire employees right suppose here department 1 department 2 department 3 three departments are there and each department have some employees right so among all employees these em employees of department 1 and employees of department 2 and employees of department 3 so if you will calculate if you will take whole all those employees what is that maximum salary right so how we will do that one so here we will do like this so department list department list dot stream and here will not apply filter because we are we are not specifying for any department what we are doing we need entire department right so here directly flat map flat map and here we will get department department dot get employees get employees dot stream so here we will get the employee stream right then map to double map to double and here employ employee dot get salary right and here max right so here what exactly we are doing first we are mapping into stream get employees department dot get employees dot stream sorry this is lambda right so here department will be there and this lambda symbol okay so what exactly we are doing here first we are first we are mapping into stream then after getting those streams it will what it will do it will flattening those those things right so let's see these examples in practically right hope you got got this one where exactly we need to apply this uh, flat map wherever wherever one list of object will be there and inside that object another list is there and you want to perform on that inside all list right so if you see here if you see here department list of department is there and each department the department containing list of employees and if you want to perform anything on the list of employee then we should go for flat map right so let's see practically that example so to reduce the video length and time already i have retained this department class and employee class right so employee contains employee id name and salary salary is double and department containing department id department name and lists of employees right hope you got it and flat map example already i have created those objects first i have created employee objects and i have created one one list so one list for one department another list for another department and another list for another department okay so here i have created three department right so each department containing one one list department here i have created using uh, creating object new department department id 101 department name ui department and here ui department employee this is the list list of employee like this three objects i have created right now let's see how we can perform so if you see here departments this is that list if you consider this is the department list okay so these departments 
on this department this department containing department object and department object containing employee list departments dot stream first we need to do what whatever the department id 101 what is the highest salary of employees right stream dot filter first we'll do not flat map filter so here department department dot department id dot equals 101 dot flat map dpt dpt dot employees dot stream okay so here i have these are these are the attributes i have defined as a public if you go to here sorry department i have not provided that private right that's why it's coming directly not i mean i am not calling getters okay so here we are doing that flattening then what we need to do dot or uh, map to double so it will return a double stream if you see it will return a double stream okay so here we'll get employee and employee dot salary dot Achha, sorry employee will not take what will take em em will take employee already we have defined no so em will take dot max here we go this will return a double and we will store this will return a uh, optional this will return a optional op optional opt io optional of double max salary d o u b l e double required optional double okay let's remove this one Achha, this is util optional right let's wait wait required java.util.optional dot dot optional Achha, optional double no worries sometimes happen right so it will return a optional double right my bad <laughs> okay then let's print okay let's print this one system dot out dot print ln max salary dot get get absolute get as double okay so control s let's print this one second so here 12 lakhs right if you see here that 12 lakhs that 101 employee sorry department of 101 ui de ui department employees right so ui department employees ui deploy ui department employees containing emp emp1 emp2 emp3 if you check here emp emp1 emp2 emp3 this three containing right this four containing so out of this four the c out of this four what is the max salary 12 lakhs right so we are getting appropriate or correct result 
now let's see that another use case another use case is what whatever those employees are present in all the department so what is that max salary of all those employees max salary of all those departments right so how we'll do that one pretty awesome here departments dot stream dot will not apply any filter flat map department will receive department dot uh what is that employees dot stream and here dot map to double here we'll get employee em will take employee already we have defined and here what employee dot salary dot max optional double it will return earlier i have given that some util optional sorry i mean optional from util package earlier i have stored that one so optional double right max salary max salary one let's take this one okay let me uh this one and let's print over here pretty good so let's uh okay before that one let's check what is that maximum salary so if you consider all those employees what is that maximum salary 15 lakhs right so 15 lakhs is that maximum salary now let's run this one and we'll gonna see double sorry departments dot stream so we'll get a streams of department then we are doing flat map and we are converting that department into a stream first we are mapping into stream then we are flattening those streams right and here we are doing a to a double one i mean we are returning a double streams of double right so we are returning a streams of double so that will get a max value right this function max is present over map to double or either integer integer of sorry streams of integer or streams of double right so then after getting that one we are storing that uh, salary into max salary here and let's run this program and we'll gonna see so it should 15 lakhs so it should print 15 lakhs oops oops why it's printing 12 lakhs Ocha, max salary earlier one right it's, it should be max salary one my bad this is my mistake this is my mistake let's run it again so earlier i took this max salary instead of max salary one it's my typo error 15 lakhs it's coming 15 lakhs right so hope you uh got an idea and uh use cases where exactly we will gonna apply this flat map and i am and i am i'm i'm saying this is the most common interview question nowadays java 8 what is flat map and where exactly we are using right pretty awesome every time whenever you are appearing for interview you will get this question what is flat map or they will ask like this like they will ask some scenario like this one department is there and each department having a list of employees and i want to map on something on li this list of employees right so that time we can go for flat map right so hope you you have uh, hope you got a clear cut idea what exactly this flat map and where exactly will gonna apply and with some uh, real time or some real use cases also i have given to you right uh, okay so uh, if you have uh, if you got benefited from this video then definitely uh, i will say you just uh, have some comment in that comment section and if you have not subscribed yet my channel please do subscribe it and uh, please uh, stay tuned for upcoming videos maybe i will upload uh, one video 
difference between normal map and flat map normal map means i mean in java it's map and flat map what is the difference among them so stay tuned thanks for watching